going to get started, and Hollywood is going to be on the pole for this event right here. As these eight cars go to take off, I think the next event will have seven drivers. As you can see, uh, the 17 of G-Dog out there on the outside pole this time by. You can see the outside line is far superior and has more numbers. A little bit of a bounce to the inside here. Got to watch out for that Daytona glitch. Uh, some people say it exists. Some people say it doesn't. I personally, I have had, I have hit it. So, it is real. Oh, Inneltown to the outside. Almost loses his grip. Gets back down to the inside. Just barely sniffing off the nose of the nine of Jonathan there. Now we have... Dan the man, I believe, out here leading this fiasco. He's got Bad Martin, I do believe, behind him. Oh, one up into the wall. The 34. Or, I'm sorry, the 20. Oh, we've got a wreck. Big wreck. Hollywood a part of it. So, the Clash sees an accident. As I believe most of them made it, except for Hollywood. He damaged himself up pretty good there as he is now going to be banged up pretty good for the rest of this stage. Dan the Man is now kind of out here trying to get the Ford of uh, Bad Martin to help him there. He's got Inneltown and Jonathan up on the high side been locked together here for a good moment now. Uh, as you can see, four, oh, four goes up, bumps a little bit into the 11. He's able to keep it off the wall. His buddy stays right onto his rear bumper there and uh, they did lose a little bit of momentum but they are going to be just fine coming down the back stretch here so the 4 and the 34 have now jumped out to a lead and clear on the cars on the high side he's going to try to maybe jump it out there he's going to get blocked though oh third place is going to jump out and try to see if they can get it done they're going to come down door to door to the line, but it's going to be Dan the Man, Bad Martin, and maybe Jinx got snuck his nose in there in front of Inneltown to get third. And it will be Dan the Man that was on the pole with, the, with Bad Martin on the outside. So here goes Jinx and Dan the Man pushing hard and early on the inside. A lot of shakiness, a lot of people bouncing off the apron here. And this is only the second of six stages of action tonight. As if you stay tuned in after this duel, they will be duel number two to determine the even positions, four through 16. And good racing by all of our pro-am drivers there Tuesday. It was good to see everybody in there having fun. I felt like it was good and competitive, real close finishes. So we got Dan the Man, uh, unfamiliar for him to not have any help as he is now the lonesome car on the outside. Going to allow Jinx to jump up to the lead for now. Hollywood going to jump out to the outside. So will Bad Martin. So now a three-car tandem has formed on the top side. There goes nine of Jonathan. He is also going to work with those guys. So now we are even four by four on the top. Four gets into the wall. Not going to be too big of an issue, I don't believe. Oh, it does kind of space them out a little bit. I believe he ruined the run. They're going to try it again. 34 is... It's going to stay committed to the inside here. So we still have Jinx out here in the lead getting pushed hard by Inneltown in the 11. The 20 there of Hamlin is also in the top three now. g Dog still poking around there in the top five. And uh, I'm with everything. g Dog might have something towards the end here. Going to be a good long run at the end, barring any cautions. Be about a 12 lap stint, I do believe. And Jinx is uh, gunning. Oh, we got some contact up into the wall on the four. That's the second time he's caught the wall there in turn number three. And that's going to push him all the way to the back of the field. Jinx still controlling the lead position here. And it's mainly the bottom line that's had all the momentum. As uh, we can't. We can't keep four cars up there on the top side. Oh, 
they get left by Dan the Man, he's going to jump down and make the bottom side a five-car race against the top side. So instantly the momentum shifts to the bottom side, allows Jinx to stay in control of this lead. But Hollywood, Town, the nine of Jonathan and G-Dog are gaining some momentum up there on the high side. If they can keep it together, I think we're going to have a race down here to the, bot uh, to the end of this stage. Jinx leading most of the laps this stage. As I can't quite tell, he does not have the lap count up right now, or I would give that to you. 20 goes way inside. Not sure what happened there. He has the room to get back on the track. He should probably do so. That's going to allow that top side to be a little bit more momentum uh, coming off this turn here. If everybody can keep it together and off the wall. Oh, Bad Martin goes off the apron. Almost spells disaster. I got hit there a couple times Tuesday in my race. 20 is way off and off uh, the pace now. Not going to be in this race at the end. Is that the 34 coming out? Possibly got pitted uh, at some point here in this stage. Eight of ten laps remaining in stage number two, duel number one here in the Ruthless Racing Pro Series. It's going to be Bad Martin, Inneltown, Jinx, Jonathan, and G-Dog, your top five in stage number two. This is stage number three. And this is where it's all going to matter. It's 13 laps here in this stage. And uh, it will be for all the even in positionings, 3 through 15. So now we are door to door coming down the front stretch. We're going to go over top and try to catch this turn like this. As you can see, this over top view is something else to see in those turns. And the outside's getting some momentum. Too many cars on the bottom for him, though. The 20 is not in this uh, at the moment. So it's not allowing that outside line to have the help that they need. Hollywood going to go down to work with the inside. Good run down the back stretch. He's going to pull even. He's going to have help. Three cars to the high side for the moment. And now Dan the Man couldn't quite pick a line there. I couldn't believe it. Oh, maybe some shiftiness there. It's not going to allow the 11 to get the lead full on as they are getting shifty down here in the last lap here in duel number one from Daytona in the Ruthless Racing Pro Series. Can Hollywood get it done? This is going to be just as close as him getting his lap back earlier. And it will be Hollywood with Jinx right there in second here in duel number one. So your winner, the 88 and owner of Ruthless Racing Series, Hollywood Double RS.